Hello, my name is Ashley Hay. It's my pleasure to be talking to you this morning. I'm very grateful to the Sydney Mechanics School of the Arts Library for the chance of making this video. Um, the SMSA Library is one of the oldest, it's the oldest lending library in Australia. It's been lending books to people since the 1830s, uh, which is a fantastic thing for all of those of us who love to read. Um, I'm also very grateful to them because they house the Thomas Keneally Centre and Tom Keneally is someone who is so fantastically supportive of writers and readers in Australia. He's done a lot for who and how we all are, I think. Um, so as I said, my name is Ashley Hay and my latest book is A Hundred Small Lessons with this very beautiful jacaranda cover here. Um, this book is my third novel, it's my eighth book. Uh, and it's set in Brisbane, which is where I live now. In a lot of ways, A Hundred Small Lessons is a love letter to Brisbane. I wrote the book when I moved there. I started working on the book when I moved there. Uh, and it was a way of me writing my way into that place, I think. It's a story of two women, an elderly woman called Elsie and a young woman called Lucy. And it's a story about how these two women navigate the strange country of motherhood in lots of ways. Elsie is getting ready to leave this interesting place and Lucy is just working out how to come into it. The book follows the stories of their two lives, Elsie through about 70 years of her life and Lucy through one very hot, wet Brisbane summer. It looks at the ways they intersect, the things that connect them, the kinds of stories that they tell themselves and tell each other in a way, those little stories that are uh, part of, a very important part of what makes us human and what we have in common. Um, as I said, this is my third novel. Uh, my earlier novels were set, one was set in Sydney, uh, The Body in the Clouds, and one was set in Wollongong, in Thurul, The Railwayman's Wife. And I'm talking to you today from Dimex in Wollongong. Um, I'm very grateful to them for the chance of being back home, as it were, and talking about this book in this place. I think one thing that's always important to talk about when you talk about writing is how to bring a story to life on the page. I know that that's something that people are really interested in. So something that I often talk to people about who are interested in writing is really bringing the senses of a place into their work. If you can bring a story to life for yourself on the page, if you can smell something that you're writing about and taste it and hear it and feel it, um, it really brings it to life for your readers. That's a really fantastic tip for anyone who's interested in writing. The other important thing for anyone who's interested in writing is reading. Um, that's why libraries matter to us. That's why places like the Sydney Mechanics School of the Arts matter to us. It's also why bookshops like Demex here in Wollongong matter to us. So I'd like to finish up by thanking both of those places for the opportunity of talking to you today and wish you all the well best in your world of words. Thank you.